considering adopting a pet, this weekend may be the perfect opportunity. Tonight, we introduce you to some deserving dogs at the Taylor County Humane Society. The nationwide Clear the Shelters event is this Saturday, and the Taylor County Humane Society is at full capacity, housing some of their dogs for as long as two years. It helps us bring in other dogs. We um, have other dogs. We have a list of people wanting to surrender dogs right now that they can't have or they're moving. Taylor County Dog Warden Bonnie Boyard says they won't let just anyone adopt a dog. They have to make sure they're going to give the dog an adequate life. They will take applications on all the dogs. And they do extended um, process on that application. They don't just say, here's a dog. So they won't go back to the same situation they come out of. Although most adoption fees are waived or reduced this weekend, Boyard says some applicants don't consider the amount of money that's required to adequately care for a dog. You can get a $20 dog sometimes, but sometimes it doesn't end up like that. The Humane Society will be working to prepare for the event this weekend and extends an open invitation for volunteers to come out and help. They need more walkers or bathers or anything. You can do laundry. You can do um, wash water bowls. There's always something to do. The Taylor County Humane Society will be open this Saturday from 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. to take applications and introduce dogs to their potential owners. Reporting in Taylor County for 12 News, I'm Bree Clark. And for a full list of local shelters in Saturday's National Clear the Shelters event, and to take our pet adoption quiz sponsored by Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration, just head to our website, WBOI.com.